So if Keychain pops up and is asking you for a password, you've changed your school password recently. So what you need to do is put the old school password that you were using prior to changing it. So we're going to do that right now. If it pops up a second time, do it again. At this point, you've entered what Keychain wanted, the, the correct password that it, it remembered. Uh, for whatever reason, when we update our school password, the Keychain does not update. And uh, the first time you log in on a machine, it's whatever you log in with is your Keychain password. So uh, we need to update it ourselves. We're going to go into Spotlight. That's this little icon at the top, and you type in keychain or just key and click on the top hit keychain access. Now, once we're in keychain access, uh, basically keychain is one password, and then it uh, the Mac operating system will constantly ask you to save passwords whenever you log into stuff, whatever that is. Uh, if you save them, it will save in your keychain uh, under passwords. So uh, what we're going to do is change our keychain password. So the current password is going to be your old password. And the new password is going to be your new password that you just updated. If you encounter an invalid password error, I'm pretty sure that this is not going to go away. Um, We've tried the current password as the new password. Sometimes it works. The newest password. Okay. Okay, so at this point it seems like we've updated it. If that doesn't work and you still have an error, file, delete keychain login, and then you can command Q, quit keychain access, and then get back to work.